Hello. So here's how to change PLDT Home Dia sa Wi-Fi name and password. First of all, open a browser and enter the default gateway for PLDT's router, which is 192.168.1.1. And it will ask you to log in. The default username is simply admin and password is 1234. But we actually have changed this already. So I'm gonna enter the password that we have chosen for for the interface. Now this login here is not the same as the Wi-Fi username and password. This is the username and password for the default gateway or the interface for PLDT's um, internet. So going in. And here's how we can change the Wi-Fi name or the name of your router just to differentiate it from other routers in the area in case there are other PLDT connections or any other type of connection actually with Wi-Fi. So just to you know show a different name for your, your own Wi-Fi connection. So changing the Wi-Fi name would be done under WLAN basic here and it's under SSID. This is the uh, Wi-Fi name. Password should be under security and under pre-shared key. You can click this button here, show a password by tick. So you would see what characters you're entering. Of course, it is recommended to choose a strong password, like at least eight characters, which should have uh, a big letter, capital letter, and small letters, numbers, and special characters. But for any other information you find here, don't touch anything. Um, these are for technical people or for technicians who know how connections like these work. And just a bonus before we go. Under basic and this part here, show active clients, you will see what devices and gadgets are connected to your, to your network especially on wireless, the Wi-Fi. Just so you know if there are other people connecting to your, your Wi-Fi, which is basically the reason why we would need to change the password for the router. So when you're done, click Apply Changes. The router will restart. Just to show, I'm gonna click this here. It's restarting and you will be disconnected from your network and you will need to re-log in using the new credentials, choosing the the new Wi-Fi name you've chosen and the password that you've also chosen. And that's it. Thanks for watching.